everybody, and welcome to episode 11 of the Pal World series. And in today's episode, we've finally begun the process of getting these wonderful, wonderful Vixies working. And we can... well, okay. I, I really just... <laughs> I've closed the world and reopened it. That's, that's about as much time as they've gotten to produce things, but they've already got a nice batch of Pal Spheres, berries, coins, a uh, bunch of other stuff too. Arrows? Damn. This dig ability really does get everything, doesn't it? And we've got a couple of these Kremises producing wool, which means I won't have to spend as much time going around killing things. Great. Now we just need to increase the capacity of the base so we can get more Vixies working here. And other such creatures. Also, they don't have food, do they? <laughs> Crap. Um, where should we put the food thing? Probably up near them, huh? Oh, <laughs> yeah. He's carrying a palisphere. Oh, but he gave up halfway. Why? <laughs> Hold on, he's gonna get it? He's gonna... Oh, no, never mind. He got the berries. Not as cool. Let's go ahead and put a feed box right here in the middle. Right right around here. That should do. Yeah, Sleep Spunk. He really is my favorite. Nobody works harder than him. You know what? At least for now, you shall be named Simmons, my right-hand man. Sorry, Lizard. Right-hand Lizard. Two hops this time. I'm gonna grab some berries from the other base. Damn, they just keep dropping them pal spheres like crazy. Look at this. I picked up like five a moment ago. Oh, they're dropping arrows too? Oh yeah. I need more Vixies. I was right to obsess about this. If I can get hundreds, and I, I, I mean that very literally, if I can get hundreds of Vixies to fuse into my current ones, I can get them dropping the tier two spheres as well. The green ones. Mega spheres. Suppose we'll take a peek around the mountains before we head back to the base and begin the process of figuring out the upgrades. Mm -hmm. For our base tier. See any creatures? Oh, I see rush ores. That's good. Any Vixies around? They're usually up here on this mountainous range area, right up around there. I believe that's where I marked on the map, too. Yeah. So we'll look around there real quick. Is my bow repaired? Yes. And use the spheres that the Vixies have been dropping for us to get more Vixies. <laughs> Dastardly. I suppose I could get more of these Capriti things as well. Wouldn't hurt. But the priority is these. Vixie. You're mine. One down. Oh, these are Kremis. Not the same. Three Kremis. Why couldn't it all be Vixies instead? It's too bad. But this is fine, too. If we can upgrade enough of them, they'll start dropping wool like crazy. There's that. See what's up? A little further. Ooh, another Vixie. You can never have too many of these things. I think I just got attacked by something. It might have actually just been an attack from the Vixie after it came out. I'm not sure. Look around for more of them. I do not see any Vixies, but what I do see is a damn duck. Do not run from me. You will love me. I will make sure of it. I will pay you in berries like everyone else. <laughs> uh, what is this? A lift mug. Uh, I guess I could make use of a lift mug. Oh, unless I push it inside of the mountain. Catch it, 65%. Don't go melding into the earth now. Nobody likes a melder. Hmm, I guess we could go down as- Whoa, wait, fall damage exists in this game. Who barely made it alive. I suppose we can look around the rest of this little biome and see if we can't find more of them. Perhaps it's time-based as to whether or not you run into Vixies or other things. Because prior it was nothing but ducks and capritis. What is that sound? I keep hearing it, but there's nothing around that makes that kind of noise. There's no birds or ducks. Quack quack. Is that Jolt Hog? No, I don't need that. Well, I guess that's about it. Back up to the base and we can begin the process of figuring out what we need to upgrade to the next tier. Really does seem like we're not gonna get too many Vixies per day until we get a nice fast flying creature. Then we can look much further away. If they are in any other biomes, I didn't see any red dots when I looked at their habitat. You can check again. Aldec, Vixies, habitat. Yes, it's just this up in this general area, north and south. Oh wait, actually, hold on. Habitat, and then if I hit nighttime, apparently they're here at nighttime as well. Interesting. Also, hold on, what? there was more options there. Previous tab, stats, oh, never mind. I guess there's just shortcuts to all that. Oh, what's that? That's a lift monk. Not what I want. It's also a lift monk in the distance. Come on. No Vixies? All daddy wants is some Vixies. All right. I'm not obsessed, you're obsessed. Let's go ahead and get out of here. We got a couple. We'll replace some of the 
grimaces with the Vixie Stoic card. Anything to produce more of those pal spheres because that allows us to make more friends. Harder, better, faster. 76%? Basically mine already. Ooh, I see a boar. Wait, did everything just respawn here? Is that what's going on? I'm seeing things that weren't here a second ago. Also, there's another spark at picking a fight. Don't get ahead of yourself, buddy. And let's go for the boar here. Two of them. What's up, nerd? Oh, I can't ram into this one. Oh, where you going, bud? <laughs> and cat. Cat. Ah, screw it. I'll use my mega spheres. I don't care. Boom. You are for sure gonna be caught. I want you too. Yep, we just caught one. And here comes number two. If you break out of that, I am gonna be irate. And you didn't, so I'm not. Now we're both happy. One day you'll be joining my workforce. Or you'll just get absorbed into one of your friends to make them stronger. We'll see. It's based on how I'm feeling that day. I am out of spheres, let's see how much they produce now. Normally you'd spend a much longer time, all well, the Vixies, or the uh, Cremises I mean, and produce quite a bit of wool. We have zero pal spheres in general, let's see how much we get from this batch. It seems as though we can basically assume that we're going to get the equivalent of two pal spheres a minute, at least, with the current setup, which isn't too bad. Wait, and I have a bunch of things producing stuff, but nothing is transferring the berries into this, so I'm going to have to have at least one creature doing that. Crap. Um, sure. We'll remove one of the things producing wool. Wait a second. Oh, right. <laughs> my Lee's Punk was transferring uh, pal spheres and such into one of the chests. Then goes my deer, hitting trees. At least he's working. It's more than I can say about some of the other pals at my base. Okay. We have to sort this out real quick. Caught more crevices. We will replace this one with the one that has the serious nature, making him a better worker. Did I catch another Vixie? I thought I did. Where are they? Right here. Dainty Eater. That's a plus. Hmm. Actually, you know what? Get rid of the crevice. Put in another Vixie. <laughs> I can hear trees getting taken down. Nice. Mm, we have another Vixie, and I'd like to have it in here, but... Uh, it'll be fine for now. We need to make room for at least one thing that will carry the berries and such into the food thing. Maybe? Nah. We'll just be extra attentive. I'll head to the other base, grab a bunch of berries, and bring them back. Seems like a good plan. Oh, T-posing Tombats like they do. I love it. Look at them go. Oh, oh, okay, some of them just... Where? What? One just fell through the earth. Excuse me? What? <laughs> Excuse me? What are you doing? Maybe if I go back to the other base and then come back, it'll fix itself. I certainly hope so. Yeesh. Let's go ahead and check this out, huh? These berries are getting cooked pretty quick. We are going to take half of them to the other base. Yeah, half should be fine. Well, at least for now. Eventually here, we'll be going pretty hard on the food as well, just to get it out of the way. Mass produce that, but that's for a later time. For now, I need to put these up in the feeding box, or feeding... Hit box? Is it just a box? Feed box. Yes. We'll keep it like this. There's more spheres. <laughs> I love it. I love how fast they produce these. If I can start fusing other Vixies into them to make their ability stronger, they'll produce it much faster as well. Even faster than they are now. Which could be pretty awesome. There's that. All right. So they've got food, they've got time, and they've got ranches to produce things. Now let's head back to the other base and figure out what we need to craft. I think it said cooler box was one of them. Nope, cooking pot. I was close. Except I wasn't at all. But I was, because I said so. Cooking pot. Where, oh where, could you be? Gigasphere, let's learn that. Breeding farm, definitely gonna learn that. Cement, sure. Cooking, cooking, right here. Cooking pot. The other thing is going to be the wheat plantation and the mill. Well, we have the wheat plantation learned, but we need seeds. Where can I get those? Who knows? But for now, we can get the cooking pot operating. Best way to do that is to, hmm, what, get rid of the campfire? I think so. You, stop crafting that, and we'll break this down and get the cooking pot in its place. Right here should be fine. Yes, yes. Having an entire base operating on these things is so much better than prior when it was just me and Simmons, my right-hand man. That Lee's Punk is a wonderful worker. Man, this does take a while, doesn't it? See, the Tombats are just snacking away while everyone else works. I see how it is. Bunch of lazy... Oh, we're done. Good. 
Let's get back to cooking those berries then. Actually, marinated mushrooms. Uh, neat. We have more recipes we can mess with. For now though, baked beans is fine. So let's get that going. Now if I stand near the pal box, if you look in the lower right underneath the pals, where it says hard at work, seems to be a good worker in good condition, etc, etc. It says current missions, build a wheat plantation and build a mill. I haven't realized this, but that just pops up and disappears based on my distance to the pal box. So I don't have to interact with it, I can just run near it and see what I need to do. Now I'm quite certain that I can get the mill done, at least if I have the level for it. Mill. Mill. Yes, it's just wooden stone, so of course I can do that. But what we're lacking is the wheat part. I don't know where to get wheat seeds. I'm probably gonna have to Google that. For now, we'll get the wheat plantation, or the, the mill, I mean. Mill, right here. Get the mill going. Why is it, there we go. Line up, like so. And let them take care of that. But now I have to figure out where to get wheat seeds. I'm sure it involves taking out, because I've gotten berry seeds from those Capriti things. I'm sure it involves taking out a creature of some sort. I just don't know what creature. I guess we'll have to go on a bit of a killing spree to find out. That's my favorite thing to do. I have a Nightwing. Do I have a second one just in case? Because this one might get bopped at some point. Nightwing. Night. Night. Wing of the night. I do not. Just the one. I'll have to go catch more later. For now it'll have to do. So, let's, for the first time, Take flight. Yeah. Not too bad. A little slow, honestly. But not too bad. I have what appears to be a left click, a tornado, and then a tackle. That takes forever. E has a nice little air cannon, and then a wind cutter. I like these. Good abilities. And I see a nightwing in the distance. You're gonna be mine. I need more of these. Many more. Yeah. Bring it, nerd. Mine is superior. Because it's got me riding it. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, balls. I mean, balls. There we go. Oh, wow, in total I picked up 22, I believe, from the Vixies. Not bad. Plus the arrows. It's literally like, go tame these if you want to have <laughs> all the resources needed to tame other creatures. Just automated. Vixies are officially my favorite creature in the game. There was another bird, wasn't there? I thought I just saw one. Am I wrong? I might be wrong. Whatever. I want this thing. Now... I don't need to be on the bird to fight it. So instead, I'm gonna throw out my weaker deer and have him fight it. Go deer. Go get it. The chillette. Chile? Chillette. Damn, it's... <laughs> my deer is just going to town. What the hell? is a lamb ball trying to fight me in the middle of a boss fight. Oh, okay. Relax, buddy. No, deer! Oh, crap, I killed it. <laughs> Damn it. Ah. <laughs> uh... I wasn't paying attention because I was trying to dodge. Whoopsie. Whatever, there will be other opportunities. But I definitely overgrinded for that little instance. I was probably supposed to do that quite a while ago. That means that I got an ancient technology point, right? Yes, I did. So that would be on this purple tree here. I have to decide what I'm going to do. Egg incubator is honestly very tempting because that would allow me to hatch the many different kinds of eggs that I've been getting, which has potential to have creatures that really are only accessible in the end game, or at least later on in the map that I can't reach right now. The feed bag allows you and your pals to automatically eat from a particular food slot in your inventory, convenience. Grappling gun, well, it does what a grappling gun does. Yeah, I think I'll be getting the incubator. We'll grab that when we get back to the base. Oh, hello, bird. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Damn, you take off fast. Me and you, we're gonna be close friends. Ow, after you're done tackling me. Not crap, he hit the lambs. Now they're gonna start fighting him. Why do you have to be dumb, bird? Alright, try some balls. 51% really isn't too bad. Oh crap, here comes the tackle. Ouch. That honestly hits pretty hard. Took out almost a third of my health. 77, and we got him. More birds. Hooray. You know, if you mash F too fast while you're riding anything, it seems like you just dismount. Never mind. Redact that statement. If you hit F at a moderately slow pace repeatedly, you dismount as well. <laughs> seems like the game will take just about any excuse to dismount you. Now I'm still curious, where the hell do I get the wheat seeds? Oh, that's water. Okay. I didn't mean to run into that lamb ball, but alright. You're done for. 
Gets me wool anyway. Hmm. That's the very beginning area. I'm not sure that I would be getting wheat seeds there. I don't know why I would. Perhaps what I should be doing is heading north. Remus, you can defeat them for wool. That's always good. Give me your flesh. I mean, not the flesh, just the fuzzy stuff on the end of it. Thanks, I appreciate it. Lift monks don't need those. Kativa don't care. What's up here? Gumas. Guma. Ooh, a fast travel point. Don't mind if I do. Really dark here. Oh. <laughs> Another instance where I... Wait, hold on. Is this an actual... This looks like a cave, but it also looks like it's caved in. Very weird. What's up here? Eggs. Kativa. And then over here, clearly a boss tower. I'm good right now. Not until I'm nice and ready. Looks like there's some syndicate thugs picking a fight over here. Now listen, I don't pick sides. So I'm just gonna have to take out all of you at once. Understand? I think you understand. If you don't, well, you'll have to just think about that as you move on to the afterlife. Which you'll be doing right now. So I said right now. There you go. Goodbye. Hey, don't run from me. He actually ran for cover. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I just supercharged into the water. Jeez. <laughs> now I have to climb back up. I saw a cage with a pal inside of it. I'm curious. What is that about? And a chest. Free stuff. I got a pal sphere. Some gold. Oh, see Daisy. Ugh. Get the deer back out. Do this. Kill this depresso because they seem to aggro on me as soon as they see me. What the heck is this thing? I guess we're about to find out. A Dazzy. Interesting. So I guess if I take them out of the cage, they just become mine. Hey, deer, come come here. What are you doing? Get get me on the let me on your back. There you go. I fight better than you fight. So just let me do the driving. Nox. What's a Nox? Kind of little furry thing? Let's attack it. Oh, it's dead. Dead is what a Nox is right now. Hmm. Some kind of item collectible. What's up here? More of these Gumas things. Grimaces. That's free wool. One down. Two down. What's over here? Sparkets. What? Why? Where am I? What happened? What? 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 What is this place? It's covered in sparkets. I already have a bunch of them, so I don't need them, but why? I'm just gonna run toward this marker on my compass, that 150 meters. Oh, it's one of the ones that I missed previously. Well, let's get it. Is that depressos in the water? Haha. <laughs> have fun drowning, nerds. Unless you can swim, in which case, I hope you have a wonderful bath. I wonder if the wild pals can actually drown. Probably not. I wouldn't bank on it. Ooh, another collectible. Up around this rock. And this is a nice open area. I have been here before, but I guess I missed this. Alrighty then. Uh, no, oh, my deer is hungry. Let me fix that. I just fed it some of its kin, like you do. Was that egg deer meat? It might have been. <laughs> I don't usually question these things too much. Feed them, feed me, berries. Wonderful. You know what? I'm curious. We're about to find out what's in here. Hopefully it's fun. Um, penguins and a big penguin. Okay. Oh, relax. Jeez. Okay, I don't care about the little ones. These can go. You guys gotta die. Ouch. Oh, the big guy's after me. Okay, this deer is almost dead. Send out the next one. Ouch, 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 ouch. Come on. Oh. I'm taking a lot of damage. And my deer is just duking it out with this thing. Good. Whoa, 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 penguin buddy. Relax. You'll be fine. Oh, dodge. Prioritize not taking damage over doing damage. Always. Just like a Tekken fight or Dark Souls boss. Okay, that's enough out of you, deer. Now it's just me and this guy. Ouch. Balls. See, we have an 18% chance. I don't think I'm going to do any more damage. Definitely just sticking with 18. 51, and yeah, not bad. Still no wheat seeds, but we caught ourselves a pen king, whatever that's good for. Thing had some slick moves, sliding across the floor and all. Let's go ahead and make our way back to the base. That was interesting. And I saw the timer on that. It said that it was roughly a full hour before it refills i guess or respawns very interesting but this has been episode 11 of the power world series
Thank you all for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next episode. But for now, goodbye.